coming at you live. We're making pierogies in the Larrick household. So uh, these are uh, discs of dough, uh, as I'm as I'm aware, and you put them in these neat, this neat little uh, uh, pierogi presser device, and you're scooping in cheese. What is this cheese? It's ricotta cheese. It's ricotta cheese. Onions. Uh huh. Salt, pepper. Uh huh. And eggs. Okay, so it's ricotta cheese, onions, salt, pepper, and eggs. I'm assuming I can find that uh, recipe roughly online. Now well, she's taking. It should not be ricotta cheese. It should be dry cottage cheese. Dry cottage. Okay, I'm gonna put you in the video. Dry cottage. Dry cottage cheese. Dry cottage cheese. Okay, yes. gotcha. Uh huh. But it's hard to find. You can find it at Kitus Okay. Butcher shop. Butcher shop. On Kings Highway. Oh, it's right Kings next to my house. Okay, so what she just did there was she took a little bit of the water and she's uh, spreading around the edges, I assume to moisten it up and make it pressable, and then give it a hard squeeze, and that presses in the pierogi, and then you flip it over. comes right out because of the flour, I'm assuming, that you flapped around on the outside of it. That's, that, was, that was a nice, smooth transition. Now she's taking a little bit extra, and she's uh, slapping some, some, some of the flour on the sides. There it is. Okay. Flips it over and slaps some more flour on the sides, and puts it on the side. And oh, look at that! That that, that great hand model action. That's great. <laughs> and uh, yeah, now they are ready to uh, throw into what is boiling water. So what happens at this point is we take one of these scoops, grab one of these pierogies, and then we throw it in this guy, which I believe she uh, the, the the lovely uh, chef just said. The idea is that you wait for it to float to the top, <laughs> and that's how you can actually tell that they're done, correct? Yes. All right. And then when you uh, actually have them finished, it looks a little bit like that. Real and doughy. And then we slap it on this grill here, and we have these finished products, which you at that point freeze for later yes. use. We put you onions either... uh -huh. and butter on them. Okay. And then freeze. Okay. Okay. You want to watch this process? Sure. Now? Yeah. Let's 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 go and slap yeah. this on here. Yep. That is. Oh, that's awesome. Mm -hmm. Now it looks like a deep fryer, but it's not. It's just boiling. Wow. Yeah. Get it in there. That water is very very hot. That is very hot water. Especially Don't want to get too close. All right. And that is how you make a pierogi.